It's time! Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. Him land that beautiful left body shot as he ends a lot of his combinations. Yeah, and we talk so much about his offense, but his defense as a boxer, right? The head's never oh, on the center John line. It's almost like his head's detached from his body. Truly a sight to behold. We'll see if he can put forth another shining performance here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 206 pounds. Diesel! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room? Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is my yeah. favorite. Fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Oh, looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, here's the head kick. It's blocked. So, oh, hurt. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. How's he gonna follow this one up? He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, that's a good right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Try to establish that jab. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Counter jab, snaps the head back. That'll get his attention. That was a thudding leg kick. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Oh, big knee. Oh, straight right. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, that right hand is on point. 
Watch his block. Oh, the uppercut is clean. Just misses with the straight right. Now we landed clean. Just missing on the high kick there. They're blocked by Lee. And they separate. He is all about that left kick to the body. Look at him dig that body shot right up to his opponent's third. Lee gets hit with that hook. That one had some pop behind it. Nice right hand. Oh, big head kick. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Connects with a right. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, collar tie. And they separate. Oh, judges had to like that uppercut. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Just unable to quite find that range. Beautiful body kick. Straight right hand, no good. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. I mean, look at the commitment to kick him in this fight. And a nice left hand there on the inside. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, round two. Big calls from Brooks Land. Now we get back to range. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Big head kick lands. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land. And he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Nice body right under the elbow. Keep your hands up now. Nice, sneaky head kick. Circling to his right. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Oh, nice slip there. It sounds simple, right? Hit and don't get hit. But this guy's defense has been sharp. Cat and mouth. Got the cat and mouth. Hit, don't get hit. He does a great job of that. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, he might be out. He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. What a body. 
Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. And everything's landing with so much power. Nice outside leg kick there. Nice kick. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Big head kick. Just missed with the left there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. What a punch. He didn't like that left hand. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down. Oh, he might be out. Goes back to that left kick once again. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Final seconds here of round number two. Able to check that kick as well. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Big leg kick land. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the home. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Lands flush with that right hand. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Just a slip there. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Come on, sneak that kick in there. That strike blocked by Lee. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, and he connects with a the punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Big elbow there, Lance. Oh, straight right. 
Strong defense there to block the shot. Oh, big head kick lands. Nice straight right lands. Three minutes remain in the round. Oh, single collar tie here. Ooh, big shot land. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Start to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach. An elbow! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Whoa! This is a great fight. Great punch landed with so much So he's sort of turtled up here, not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Back to the feet now. Big kick land. And both guys really thrown with authority. <laughs> Tries the flying knee to no avail. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too, because when you start reaching on to catch that kick, here comes the high kick, and then you're in a lot of trouble. Lee's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Oh! He's out! It's over! It's over! <laughs> I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship-winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at four minutes, 12 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Diesel. And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoy the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done. And he should be very proud of the work he and his coaches got done tonight.